man. So we got our construction crew leased for our building of our new farmyard. Man, I'm surprised this GMC has it in it. Let's get to it. Alright, so I'm basically just taking this to my place. So I did do some work off screen. I probably should have uh, videotaped me working. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that you guys would have enjoyed uh, me doing some bulldozing. So uh, I uh, got our bulldozer. I just love that thing. So I ended up having it shipped here. So it's up there and I was having a little fun. So if you know from the last video, wow, I'm really having a hard time getting up in here. Let's try to get up here and uh, get our equipment. I purchased this house and the farmyard was a little neglected. Let's just say uh, the house inspector found a bad foundation on the house. So that was a huge expense. So I ended up bulldozing the whole house. And I bow while I was doing it, I bulldozed a few buildings because the inspector said uh, basically a lot of the ground settled here and the foundations were just bad or they weren't right to begin with. So I was using my bulldozer, bulldozed it all in, now they're all covered up. So I, I do have to do a little bit of leveling still so I got to get the 4440 get that done that's why I lease this equipment here because uh, today we are gonna do some buildings so I want to put up some buildings around this place so I I gotta wait for some supplies to come in but I gotta level this all out I'm thinking just contemplating here I might move the house right over here so I do own this piece of land. This is probably my biggest field I have. So fairly big field. So I'm thinking about building a house somewhere around right here. Uh, then I can kind of see out, see my farmyard. I don't have to be around my uh, stinky cattle because uh, I am going to get back into cattle. So and then I think I'm just going to put a, a, a little shop probably right here some type of shop something like that haven't for sure figured out what I want to do but I'm gonna do something so and then right over here I'm going to put a uh, another building not for sure what yet but we'll get it figured out so at first I'm gonna unload my uh, tools here my uh, construction tools. I should have probably leased these earlier so I could have used them for my demolition. But uh, I do like these tools. I, I just think that cat is cool looking. Let's get this unloaded. It's kind of blank in this cab. So basically this is to help put up the walls, put up everything. And these controls on here are uh, backwards and they kind of mess me up sometimes so a little bit hard to uh, deal with I guess at times because I'm so used to them going one way you pull back it goes up nope gotta go forward it's basically the controls are inverted really kind of annoying but I guess I'll get over it all right so I'm not for sure where they're gonna unload all the equipment or all the our sub building supplies basically but uh i think i'm gonna jump into that sky and uh, i'm gonna
Couldn't get him off my mind I told him I want that great love Like standing in the middle of a bonfire You don't know how you got there But you hold tight Knowing that you can't get burned Just tell me how we lost track Of everything but each other I honestly don't know And tell me how we messed up Drifting away from each other Didn't want to let you go But it's not easy, so tell me how to let go Cause you really seem to know how to carry on on your own Ever since I got a good look in his eyes I just knew that he was special He said he wanted to take it slow But I couldn't help that I wanted to take it to the next level Cause I wanted that great love Like standing in the middle of a bonfire You don't know how you got there but you hold you can't get burned Just tell me how we lost track of everything but each other I honestly don't know And tell me how we messed up Drifting away from each other Didn't want to let you go oh, oh, oh. Cause we want different things And I have to deal with it But it's not easy So tell me how to let go Cause you really seem to know How to carry on 
day in late July and everything turned upside down. I almost lost track of time as weeks went by. I couldn't get him off my mind. Like 90 degrees, it's making me hot, and he has the same effect on me. It's just something about the way that he's making me feel. My insides are out, I just wanna shout his name. Ah, oh, my body's giving up on me. 
Cause I don't know what to do with my fingertips Ah, oh, I wanna run up through his hair But I'm trying not to stare mm -mm. I get a little starstruck when I see Shaking from the urge of being with him I act a little dumber when I try to get his number I'm so nervous that I'm losing grip of myself Ah, my body's giving up on me Cause I don't know what to do with my fingertips Ah, I wanna run up through his hair But don't stare I get a little starstruck when I see him I couldn't hit him even if I tried Just moving this stuff around so we got some extra building material we got to get rid of here why we got this all right so let's see where we are at shut that off for a little bit so we built this giant new building I know this is a little bit new for this series but hey I had 2.5 million dollars to spend. Why not? I thought I kind of like the looks of it. I think it kind of goes well with the other stuff. Uh, so we ended up putting this island in the center of this yard. And before I get too far in here, so this map creator is probably the best of all times. So No Creek was my one of my favorite maps in 17. This is by far, I think, in all the maps I've seen, the most beautiful map created in 19, for 19 only. This, this map is stunning. And I know this farmyard was immaculate prior to. It just wasn't mine, so I decided to change it up slightly. I wanted a house that I can interact in and that was the biggest thing I wanted because I got a brand new uh, rancher over there across the street so I can kind of and it's just perfectly placed I can just keep an eye out on my whole farmyard make sure nobody is coming to vandalize my stuff like Jim's place but so we broke this up a little bit I just created it how I wanted it. So the the map creator is by far the one of the best out there. So I'm not saying that he didn't do a great job. I'm not. And I'm sure he's going to be mad that I uh, messed up his map. But uh, this is why we got this creation tool in Farming Simulator, so we could do this type of stuff. So why wouldn't we? Of course we want to do it. Of course we want to make something our own. Much rather than just farm on something you created. I'm sorry. That's just how it is. Uh, but saying that is for the respect of the map creator. Because I know he spent way more hours than I spent on this one farm. And probably this one farm he created. Way hours and hours and hours. This will stay private and this will be my map mod uh, a slight modification to the actual I kind of like with our uh, 
our garage right here or our shop so this will be our main shop so we tore down the house we put this shop in uh, we also put a uh, over a cold storage this will help store some of our uh, either our cattle equipment or our farming equipment we put an old shop barn there I just like the looks of it something about that makes it's so much more realistic for me I kept this barn because I kind of like it to be honest so almost well placed everything is well pretty well I'm not completely done with this map I think I might treat just uh, tweak a few more things with it just a slight modification and I know all you guys out there that just hate it when I put a whole bunch of trees down on the map I really didn't put that many trees so I put a lot of little brushes and everything I might put a few more little trees around just because that's what makes it realistic looking I did make a few scenic views like this corner uh, we're way down here coming up to our house here right here we got the flag entrance we got our gated entrance here what I always wanted in a house of my own love that windmill in the background there might get a little bit annoying when I'm sleeping though oh we gotta push the button there we go just love the view I get to watch watch my Huskers play Michigan State what a great game that was uh, I still have a few modifications to do maybe a few more trees of course you know I just love putting trees on a map but and I forgot so this is Medicine Creek. This uh, will be the link to the Facebook site will be down below. That's the version one of Medicine Creek. So you will get basically what the map creator created. And trust me, this map is amazing. So great map. I might have to do a few more modifications just for role play sake. You know, you got to have a few, you know, maybe, you know, stores or something in there just to play some role play. I mean, no one wants to just hang out at different farms. But uh, thank you all for watching, and I will see you later here in Missouri. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share, and subscribe. See you next time.